Oh, what do we have here? Day nine thirteen. Another early morning. Got the pup. We're walking. Going on the buddy run, work. Oh, and then we could possibly be heading up north today. I'm not sure about that. I woke up feeling pretty tired. It's tough to get to sleep after the late night run. So, if we don't go tonight, then we're leaving early in the morning. We'll see how today plays out. Uh oh. What do we have here? Who is this little one? It's oh my goodness. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at you. <laughs> Look at you. You're just a happy little puppy, aren't you? Go. Oh my goodness. Go oh my goodness, yeah. So excited. So excited. <laughs> You're such a good one. Oh, what a good puppy. Okay, hold on. Look at that little face. Look at that little happy face. So happy to be awake in the morning. Go get some exercise, huh? You are so excited and so happy. What a happy girl. Oh, okay, okay. The belly rubs. You did good, you deserve some belly rubs, yes. Okay, oh my gosh, you are so excited, aren't you? Oh, look at that puppy energy. Look at that puppy, you're a good puppy. Oh, you're dirty now. Let's clean you up. Let's clean you up. Okay, there you go. Well, that was a fun little run I had with Mary. She brought out her and Tyler's dog, Winnie. And just, they said Winnie needed some exercise, so got a little run in, took a little breaks when we needed. She was sniffing everything when everyone to say hi, like a little puppy does. And now, we got back to the car and she was laying down with her belly rubs. And I must have said an anthill or something because I got a bunch of little ants all over me, probably 10 on each leg. And so after they started biting a couple of times, I realized they were there. So now I'm just trying to not itch them like crazy. I don't do well with ant bites. Not allergic, but man. Scratching sensations kicking in right now. I don't know if you can see any of them. There's a couple right here. Oh, in there. There's somewhere in there. Let's take a look when we get back. But I'm gonna go try to run a few more miles. Got plenty of time. It's only 5:46, so I need to leave within an hour, which is plenty of time. Which I'm not gonna run a full hour right now, but a couple extra miles to help. Soften the blow for that 40, 40 miles a week should do good. So I think at least another one out, one back will be good. All right, good news. At 3.6 miles right now and got a nice view going. Also, the run helped take that little sting out of those ant bites. So, morning. So, I still feel them. They're not as bad right now. I don't feel like I have to itch them. Just got my mind on something else. Keep them busy, keep them moving. Now I barely feel them, which is a good thing. Cause they were getting to me. And so it was either stay there and scratch them or get moving and stop worrying about it. Stop letting your mind just feel those ant bites. So all about what you focus on. Decided to focus on running. Mile four, 715 overall, 36.13. Rolling, I'm actually really feeling good today. I'm surprised with the quick turnover from last night. I thought I was gonna be more lethargic and tired, not hydrated, but yeah, I feel good. I think we're gonna go for a solid six mile run. Yeah, plenty of energy left. 
not sweating terribly bad. All signs are go for good miles today. I had to stop for a sec. Saw that picture. Man, looked a little majestic with the sun coming off and just sitting there being all patient. So I had to, like, you know, we gotta enjoy the run. We can stop for a second. I thought I was gonna move or fly away. I just kind of sat there, stared at me for a bit. So, pretty cool I got that moment. I actually passed on the way out. And then, it's alright, it's turn around. When I turn around, if it's still there, definitely gonna get a little picture or video. It was still there. Alright, six miles is done. 51 minutes, 28 seconds. Alright, time for work. I'm out of work, I'm getting ready to go up north today. It's actually my mom's birthday, so. Happy birthday, Mom. I love ya. Hopefully you're doing well. Thanks for always watching the video, so I know you're gonna see this. I'm already saying to you happy birthday, so I'm not gonna embarrass myself twice in one day. But once is good, and you heard it. I think you got a little laugh out of it. So, it served its purpose. But now, I'm just gonna go get gas, get back, pack, walk the pup, get ready to go, and then head up north. Probably check in once we get there. Three hours later. Well, look who made a special guest appearance. My birthday. <laughs> say hi, mom. Hi. No, say hi, mom. Like your future, your future self. Say something to yourself when you watch it later. You're old. Oh, don't say that. I don't want <laughs> something positive. Like... <laughs> well, we made it down for her birthday. We just just got in. We ate a little bit, and now. She's prepping some carne asada. We're gonna be eating good tomorrow. But yes, and I hope I'll have leftovers for the week. Mm, you forgot that you have three boys. Mm -hmm. That's true. So, leftovers. I mean, does Chris have to eat? <laughs> he doesn't have to eat, right? We can put one off the, the food island. I don't know. If you're gonna be worried about somebody, I'd be worried about Georgia. Why? I think Georgia eats more than Chris, don't you? Yeah, but I'm saying we can kind of like draw straws mm -hmm. and, and one of them can not eat. And that way there's, we have leftovers for somebody. Mm -hmm. is, that, is that okay? Yeah. Well, we have ribs too. That's true, that's true. Wait, but now that I got you on camera, I need you to answer the question, Mom. Oh, did you guys want dessert? Yes. Me too. Mom, I need you to answer the question. Yes. Who is your favorite son? I need you to say it though so that I can rub it in Joe and Chris's face later. David is my favorite son. Thank you. In your face, Joe and Chris. <laughs> in your face. Bah. Come on, Joe and Chris. You know I love you. Look. No, Take a look at this cool dessert my mom made. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. Is that how this one came out? Yeah. That is a fruit pizza if I've ever seen one. I don't think so. I don't think so. No. Jennifer's over here helping slice the, the meat up for the sada. We're focused on dessert right now. All smiles. Although, you know, Charlie, it is, I think, past your bedtime. Maybe you'd say. Yeah, you do. You gotta get up early and make breakfast tomorrow, right? You said you're gonna make my mom breakfast tomorrow for her birthday. So you should go to sleep early so you can wake up early. Yeah, so we're gonna hang out a little bit and eat before we call it a night. I think we're done. We just drove the two it was just I have two hours. And we got in, took the pup for a short, short walk. On my mom is feeding the dog. So She's over here. She knows what she's doing. She's looking for food. We're gonna call it a night. So run your life with health and happiness and have a good night.
Slow down there, Quicksilver. 